Good morning and welcome to Distance Learning Summer School on this day of June 14th, 2021. Student Expectations and Behavior Policy. Lodi Unified students are expected to recognize and adhere to the following student expectations and behavior policies established for distance learning summer school. Daily attendance in distance learning classrooms will be required. Students must check in with teachers daily by the teacher's established time or they will be marked absent. So my established times are 8 a.m. and 11 a.m. Our lunch is at 1030. So when we come back from lunch, um, so yeah, so we'll come back from lunch and um, between 11 and 1115. Okay, we'll say cutoff is at 1115 for the second check-in. Active participation in virtual classrooms will be monitored and weighed into final grade. So I'll do posts, uh, which I call discussions, and you can type in your contribution there and that will be considered active participation. Also talking as well as other things, okay? Uh, students will be expected to follow course schedule and syllabus as specified by teacher. Be on time for virtual classroom meetings and do not log off early. Immediately notify your teacher of any technical internet issues. Alternative ways to communicate with your teacher will be shared on the course syllabus. You have my email, all right? You can also use um, Google Classroom, as some of you have done, done already. Students are expected to check teachers' Google Classroom daily and submit assignments on time. It is the student's responsibility to reach out to their teacher to determine, to determine miss, missed assignments. Students will follow academic honesty and not engage in plagiarism or cheating. Asterisk, failure to check in with your teacher or submit an assignment by its deadline will result in one incident referral. Students will be removed from course upon receiving three, three incident referrals in one semester class. Behavior policies, Lodi Unified reserves the right to monitor all conversations occurring during a, a virtual classroom. We ask that parents remind their children about the importance of refraining from inappropriate comments and remarks during class time. It is the intent of this policy to protect students from exposure to inappropriate information. Students, staff, and parents hold a joint responsibility to ensure that inappropriate material is not displayed or available on any computer during a distance learning classroom or activity. The following is a list of unacceptable behavior, which may result in an incident referral for noncompliance. Tier one, bullying, badgering, and or using harassing, abusive, or obscene language, intentionally offending another person. Tier two, promoting the use of drugs, alcohol, or tobacco, or any unethical behavior with the intent to hurt or harm another person. Student consequences for noncompliance. Failure to meet distance learning student expectations or behavior policy will result in a noncompliance incident referral and subject to the following consequences. First incident, verbal warning with an email or phone call to parents, guardian, by teacher. Incident two, parent, guardian, and student conference with administration subject to course removal if incident is considered tier two by summer school administrator. Incident three, student will be removed from course immediately, no credits will be issued. 